I was gonna video you from when you like came down there. Oh yeah. Um, but yeah, she jumped off my lap and landed on her back. Oh. So yeah. Ouch. Yeah, I thought I was like, oh. That's why I was sitting holding her when you came in. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everyone knows you're there. Everyone knows you're there. Did I give her one without you? I'm so sorry. So this is your last hair trim Before here. Before I move. Before you become cutting crew. That's right. Wow. I knew I had to book him one last time. You did. Got to get it nice for trading. Oh, excellent. <laughs> Yeah, I've got four shifts left now. Four shifts? Four shifts. I finish on Friday at five. And I move Saturday. And Saturday come in. So what number are we going to do on the back and sides? Go for two. Go for yeah. two? Okay. <laughs> Two's fine. I don't think so. I have a line of So... <laughs> Do you remember that advert? <laughs> yes, I do remember that advert. One hundred percent. Lionel Bear doesn't have his hair cut like that. He does if it comes here. Oh, for a sharp exit. Yeah. Was that for um? Was that a Heineken advert or was it a cigar advert? It was sharp lar um, harp, harp lager. Harp lager. Sorry for a sharp. Yeah. S Harp stays sharp to the bottom of the glasses. So. Yes, that's it. <laughs> that's going back some Aces. years, Aces. isn't it? Aces. Yeah. You can't see Harp Lava now. No. Like you're part of the Guinness Oh, did it? Yeah. Yeah, it's a so, when are you going to be back? When's your first weekend back or your first day back? I don't know here? yet. Do not know yet. Do not know. I should get my roster for May in mid-April. So you get four weeks notice. Wow. Yeah. So I'm going to see your name booked up um, like four weeks in advance? I'd like to think so. Wow, that's Whenever cool. I get three days off in a row, I'll come down. So hopefully that's somewhat often. So I'd like to see some of the work lot again, a couple of friends as well. Obviously mum and dad. Obviously, I saw Mum opened a new um, Tui office. She did. She did. Well, she wouldn't take the scissors. They said, "Do not don't stop them to it." We didn't know. Oh right. Yeah, that's hard. No, 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 you do it. Of course. Dad did it. I ended up doing it. Did you? I ended up using scissors. The shop is so much better. Is it? Yeah. You what? Sorry. We're gonna set on all the suits. I don't think so. That's alright. Yeah, I've done a good job. Are you like, is it a lot brighter in the new shop? A though? lot brighter. Yeah, it's the really perfect size. It's nice out the back. Everything's brand new. Oh, we actually look like Tui now. So, when you've passed all of your training, yes. how long is your contract for Tui uh, cabin crew? Is it's it seven months. So seven I'll be months. back. In early November, back in retail, back home. Yeah, it'll be long by then. Yeah. You've got to come back before then. Yeah. <laughs> you leave it two months and you look like you've got an afro. I know. You're it grows so thick at the front, isn't it? That's what we always try and, yeah, yeah, yeah. cut down so it doesn't grow over that way. Oh, are you going up to Manchester? Yes, that's right, it's Alford. Mm. Yeah, I'm not going up to Manchester. No. <laughs> to trim your hair. I'm guessing you Mobile barber stuff. <laughs> I have got 650 subscribers now. Yep. It's gone up by like 100, hasn't it, since I last saw you? I think so. Something yeah. like that. 650. Oh, that's really good. Getting all the views. <laughs> yes. I've just done. Um, yeah. <laughs> I've just done Josh's hair, and he had on his last video, which was it says two weeks ago, but I sometimes I post straight away. Sometimes I post like a week later. Right. 
and there was 12 comments on his post oh, about go and have a number one job <laughs> and he's like no no so i showed him all of the comments today while recording them and it was like come oh, on someone else would have it done if you have it done no maybe he's got, i've got from a definite no now to a maybe during summer so next time oh uh, yeah he comes every three weeks oh really yeah every three weeks to have he has number two all over. Okay. Yeah, his hair grows so fast. It's like yours. Like mine, yeah. Yeah, most important haircut, yeah. It is. <laughs> So what's the first thing you've got to do when you go to Manchester? Unpack. <laughs> yeah, and then do a trial run and get into the airport. We have a good good week before we actually start training to get settled in. Right, see okay. The city. So when you're doing your training, are you training at the airport? Yes, yeah, so we have two weeks at Manchester, then we go down to a proper training centre, which is at East Midlands. So oh, it's split right. into two, it's a month total course. So East Midlands each. is Birmingham, isn't it? Pretty much, yeah. So you're not in Birmingham. Away. Not going to be too far from home. And then I'm back up to Manchester after. They coach you up and down, give you a hotel, which is good. Oh, that's good. Yeah, it's not bad. Not well. They call right, it not. Definitely. They call it Nottingham East Mids, but I don't think there was a, um, an airport in Nottingham. It's just outside. You've got Birmingham Airport, then you've got East Midlands Airport, and East Midlands is like Derby, Nottingham area. I thought East Midlands was Birmingham. No, two separate airports. Birmingham's really? actually bigger. Is it really? Yeah, Birmingham Airport. You can go along all from that. Awesome. It is. Yeah. So when we always when we've flown, we've always either gone. Gatwick or Luton? Oh yeah, yeah. So, I think it's Gatwick. Yeah, Gatwick. I like Gatwick. I think it's Gatwick. No, when we've gone to America. Right. Yeah. Yes, that's it. Gatwick or Heathrow usually. No, I don't think we've been to, I'm not sure if we've been to Heathrow. No? I can't remember. <laughs> the last time we flew was 2013. Oh, we went to? Uh, we went to Florida for uh, my 40th birthday. Probably Gatwick then. Yeah. We, um, yeah, we don't, because it was our 20th wedding anniversary as well. Ah, oh, special one. So, yeah, we, I wanted to swim with dolphins. Uh, all I've ever wanted to do is swim with dolphins. So, my 40th birthday and our 20th wedding anniversary, we swam with dolphins. Oh, that's sweet. And you can see the picture in there. Oh, yeah. What was that, SeaWorld? Um, Discovery Cove. Oh, right, yeah. Oh. Um, God, time flies, doesn't it? Yeah. Years. And last year was my 50th birthday, and do you know what I'd done for what? my birthday? I cut hair. <laughs> worked, you worked it? I worked my birthday, yeah, my 50th birthday, I worked. At your old shop? At my old shop, yeah. Oh, wow. I did not know that. You didn't? No. That's why I'm, I love my job. It's like Michael keeps on saying, Oh, we need to time. Well, we need a holiday. We need a holiday. It's like, yeah, okay. I don't want the time off work. <laughs> no, this before it was. Oh, if I have time off work, I've got to close. And yeah. if I'm closed, I can't make the rent. If I'm closed, I can't make the wages. Yeah. Now it's yeah. Bit different. I've got to get busier. If we go busier, then we'll go away for New Year. Not New Year. Um. November. Yeah, that'd be nice. Keep getting spam ringing me. Do ya? Yeah. Yeah, I want to go to New York. That'll be good. Yes. I want to go for... I'd like to go for Thanksgiving. Oh yeah, and they put the um, the Rockefeller tree up after that. I think that don't they put it up for Thanksgiving? Maybe. <laughs> Not sure. Yeah. What was that? I don't know, but I heard it. You heard that, <laughs> yeah. didn't you? It was like a millisecond of a ringtone. Oh my god, that freaked me out. <laughs> <laughs> that really freaked me out. I got goosebumps. That's now. really that's, odd. That's really weird. That was definitely your voice, wasn't it? No, it wasn't me. 
No, but it was sounded like a voice. Yeah, it was like. <laughs> How odd. How, how weird is Pops that? Pops up with something. No one questions that we I need to get my friends around here. <laughs> Chase out anything that's not meant to be in here. Well, the dogs haven't reacted, so it's nothing bad. Yeah, that's, that's it. Oh, God, yeah. I think Harlequin's in a deep sleep. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> so it's pets. I think they're more comfortable here, aren't they? Yes, definitely. Yeah, less stressed. Well, when I'm in the garage or the new home salon, yes, uh, they're going to have to have their jackets back on because we're not actually at home. Oh, okay. Because they'll be working, won't they? So I won't be at home like now. I'm actually at home. But you because through, yeah, you walk through that door and that's my kitchen. Yeah, yeah. That I'm in a separate building, classed not as ah, at home. Interesting. So yeah, they have to wear they have to wear their jackets again with their ID badges. Bless. I was following this uh, French lady on she on TikTok or YouTube, right? And she comes over for um, I think she's French or she's in um, Brussels or somewhere like okay. that. But she's got a a guide dog. Yeah. I think it's a guide dog, but it looks like a whippet. Oh. Right. Uh, it's got his own passport. Right. Gets on, gets on the plank, sits by her feet, comes in, and everyone at control know, like in, when they arrive in England, and you got the pet people standing by to scan the dog. Yeah. Look at the the pet passport, and then she can go on. Okay. I've been following that for a while, and it was like, wow. That's vocal. That is. Yeah. Could you imagine Harlequin just sat on the plane with you? Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> Can you imagine her when she's got the zoomies? <laughs> like, I mean, she, how many times did you come in when she had the zoomies? <laughs> Probably under it. <laughs> yeah. Having the zoomies. I mean, when she's got her jacket on, she's... Professional. <laughs> she is a, look, for a little bit more professional. She doesn't, when she's got her jacket on, she doesn't take treats from anyone. Really? Yeah, she won't take treats from anyone apart from me. Um, Michael's tried to take her off of me when she's got her jacket on, and literally she puts her paws around my leg. She will not leave my side. But she hasn't got her jacket on now, but if I go inside, uh, like in or go upstairs, She'll follow she's you. literally standing next to me. If I go up a step, she goes up a step. Aww. Coming down, she scares me because she stands behind, she's behind oh, me. So a, couple, down. so a couple of times I've lost my balance and I've gone backwards and I've had to move her out the way. Oh so I thought I was going to sit on her. <laughs> But was it this morning? I think I got up about five o'clock and my sugar level was really low and right. she was like letting me know. And I fell down the bloody stairs, didn't oh my I? God. And like she was screaming and I thought I'd hurt her, but oh. she came running down the stairs screaming and jumped on me and was like slicking my face. So it was like, yeah, I'm fine, I'm fine. And Michael didn't hear anything. How? <laughs> you tell me how he did not hear me falling down the stairs. <laughs> Deep sleeper. Possibly, yeah. Scared the crap out of Yes, exactly. And I got back with him, he woke me up and I went, uh, it's not time to get up yet. And he goes, yeah, it is. It's like, mm. <laughs> but yeah, fell down the stairs. At least you're okay. Yeah, I thought. How are your fingers? Oh, yeah, fine, look. Fine now, yeah. I've got to go and have another x-ray. Fully healed. It's well, fully healed, but yeah, I can't, I can get it to that far. Right. But I can't get it down like that. Right. You're I mean, almost there. I am, but I can still feel the bones moving. Ooh. So yeah, I've got to have a go and have another x-ray of my hand. Check the progress. Yeah. I did break it again though. I fell over in here and I re-broke my finger, so... Did you? Yeah. Which, what, both or the little one? No, the little one. Well, I suppose it's extra. 
Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, when I've done it, it was pointing that way. Oh. 35 seconds. So it was like. Thank you. First of all, when I landed, I thought I'd like broken my neck. Oh my God. And it was like. I went like that or something <laughs> and I saw that I had blood all over my face and it was like, oh God, Ooh. I've lost my teeth and I started counting my teeth. I was like, not my teeth. And then um, it was like, oh, my nose. And it was like, I can't move my arms. Oh my God, I've broken my neck. This is what I'm going through in my head. And then I just lifted my arm and just wiped and was like, well, I definitely haven't broken my neck. And then I moved the cupboard and it was like, I then realised. I think that's broken. <laughs> Like that, and I must have been on the floor for about an hour Christ. before I could actually get up. It's the adrenaline rush, isn't it? Yeah, definitely. And I've locked the um, the shop as well, so no one could get in because I left the keys in the lock. Hot. Michael was in bed with um, really bad vertigo. Oh, right. So I was there on my own. I couldn't call for help because all the phones were on the desk and I was in the toilet. Yeah. So, yeah. Just typical. Yeah, just a typical day. You should have seen my leg. My leg was black from my ankle all the way up to what, my... bruises? Yeah. Oh my from my ankle all the way up to my hip. That, that was sore. Yeah. It was like, how was that like that? And I'm like, Michael's going, how did you, how did you land? How did you fall like, like that? I don't know. <laughs> but I should not have been climbing a ladder in the first place. Wow, no. Especially because I've got diminished feeling in my legs. So I should not have been up there. No, you definitely not. Not on your own. No. But needs must. Yeah. <laughs> Earthquake resilience development in Turkmenistan. Boom. Right, I'm sending it out as much as possible for you. Thank you. Sure is. Rumor is his parents were show dogs. Did you get him uh, from a breeder? No, he's a rescue. I've been thinking of doing that. How's it working out? Well, so far, it's so good. How long is your shift going to be then? So, on. Friday it's 9.5 yeah. and then Saturday morning is when we move up so I've literally got four days left now Wow. and that's it you know your mum is going to be in tears I know you? she's already said to me bless her and don't be surprised if all the baby photos start coming up <laughs> So how long is the um, course, work, not the course, work, the training all together? Is it just a month? Yeah, four weeks basically. Wow. Very intense though, I think it's five days a week, home study, and you do a test every day, multiple choice. Obviously when you actually get on the planes you have a couple training flights too. Yeah, but how many training flights have you already had? None. Well, officially, Come on, that's, that's officially none, but... Officially <laughs> none, but how many times? I mean, I've like, when you used to come back after your holidays, it would be, oh, I pushed the trolley. Oh, I know, years back, yeah. Yeah, I went into the cockpit. Always want to do it, haven't I? Yes. <laughs> And you were named, they named you over the, the uh, tannoy <laughs> as well. That's it. God, I can't believe you remember that. Oh, I remember, I've got very good memory. You have. Actually. You have. You must have been... I think I was 11, 10, 11. You said that, 8 or 9? 8 or 9 would be Florida. Probably about 9, 10. 9, 10, 11 was when it started. Those, those summers. Very good memory, I'm impressed. <laughs> But yeah, you've always wanted to be cabin crew. Always. Always. We got this enormous thing done, and I feel a responsibility to make sure it doesn't get undone. 
It's going to be weird, you're not coming in. I know. It's every three, four weeks at the moment, isn't it? It has been for the last few months. Thank you. Yes, every every three or four weeks, yes, definitely. That's it. And that's going to be, what, every two to three months? Probably. Oh, I'm just going to get a phone call. I'm heading back to Peterborough. Can I get my hair done, please? Are you free? Yeah. to try and get that like, curl out is that okay just at the front because it always grows <laughs> like this way <laughs> no i take it shorter and shorter each time I know. and you still ask me to take it, it out. still grows that way well that's because that's the way your hair grows it's just the hairline isn't it <laughs> it is i can take it shorter thank you but i don't want to take it so it's the kink that is just there yeah because that'll look weird <laughs> that would look very weird <laughs> And you've got to have your ID photo. I have. And you don't want to have like a dodgy hair, <laughs> hair cut for your ID photo. Like a massive crinkle. Yeah. And that's, everyone is going to notice it. They're going to go on the thing go, who cut your hair in that picture? <laughs> and you don't want that. No. And I don't want that. And neither that. do you. <laughs> no, I don't want that either. You have to tell me how many people you meet that are from Peterborough. Yeah, see if I come across any. Yes. Peterborough my na my neighbour actually went to Spain. Yeah. Um, went there for three weeks. Oh, nice. And the first, well, I think they went to the first restaurant and it's like, oh, where are you from? It's like Peterborough. No way. My grandparents live in Linkside, which is literally just there. As if. <laughs> Telling you the truth. Yep. You it's don't usually meet that many people from Peterborough, do you, as well, when you're abroad? Do you know, when we went to Florida for our anniversary, Yeah. Well, we was in line for the Kraken. Oh, right? yeah, 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 yeah. Right? We've been on that. And I got, well, I'm short, sure, aren't I? So yeah. I got, <laughs> it was like, oh, for God's sake, it was one of my clients. It no. Like, he literally leant over two people and went like that on my head. <laughs> And like Michael went, who's that? I was like, one of my clients. And he goes, what the hell are you doing here? I went, I'm in line to go on the Kraken. <laughs> and so all these people, we, we were talking, all these people went past us. We carried on talking. And blame me if it didn't break down. No. Yep, it broke down. And it was like, that is, yeah, we should never have been on that. Just got to show everything happens for a reason. <laughs> uh, yep. There's karma for everything. Yes. And him tapping, oh, me on, that's better. him tapping me on the head Thank was you. karma not to get on the ride. <laughs> and do you know what? We never got, we never went on it. No. No. We have been on that, haven't we? Years back. Where is it? Bush Gardens? Or is it? No, no it's Universal, isn't it? Um, One of the bigger parks. Cracker. No, it's um, SeaWorld. Is it? Yeah, I'm sure the Kraken, yeah, the Kraken. I'm sure sea the World Kraken's Bush Gardens, isn't it? you got the Manta Ray. Manta Ray? Yeah, the Mantas at Bush Gardens. Yeah, because they're all linked, I think. Mm. Bush Gardens, SeaWorld Aquatica. We never went to Bush Gardens. Well, like it's an actual park. Is it? Yeah, Bush Gardens is, yeah. It's like a proper theme park. It's really good. Oh, no. If you go back... <laughs> yeah, I don't know if I can actually travel or sit, th yeah, sit there. Nine but and a half hours. Yeah, so. I don't think I can do that now. And then overnight coming back. Yeah, I can't do that. Yeah. <laughs> No, I fall over just standing here. Oh my god. I can't believe I just fell over. <laughs> well, at least they fell, not you. That is very true. I'm going to have to pick all that up now. Oh my god. Don't worry about it.